Hi guys, in this quick video I will provide you some information regarding the Xenon headlights of Hyundai Santa Fe, second generation produced between 2006 and 2012 and basically uh, I will explain the Xenon system if you have a low beam failure at your Xenon headlight, Santa Fe Xenon headlight se second generation, you will know where to look and what, uh, what to replace eventually. As you can see, in this uh, headlight, the Xenon system is pretty simple. It consists of one D D1S type Helamate Xenon ballast and one D1S type Xenon bulb. Any D1S type Xenon bulb will fit your headlight, but your Xenon ballast, fact factory fitted Xenon ballast is Helamate. Uh, actually, this ballast is located underneath your headlight with a part number 00040547. This is the uh, Hyundai part number actually, but it's also you can use also the other numeration. This ballast. 5DV009000 middle line 00 is used at many makes and models at European cars. So these both these two ballasts are same. So if you have a low beam failure at your Xenon headlight second generation, it means that given the fact that you your wiring is okay and all the other stuffs are okay. It means that either your xenon bulb, D1S type xenon bulb is faulty or your ballast unit. If you have a water ingress condensation at your xenon headlight, it's most likely that you have a ballast failure. But in order to be sure 100%, uh, just swap the D1S type xenon bulb, bulbs between the headlights, take the working one from the working side headlight and put it to the non-working side headlight. Here your Xenon system in action. The, D, the ballast unit is powering the D1S type bulb. So if any of these fails, it means that you will not have low beam anymore. Thanks for watching guys. Please consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, just write down in the comment sections. Thanks for watching again. All the best. Bye for now.